Well, hello, my name is Todd. I am the owner of Todd's Amazing Tours, and I'm super excited about this next two-day tour that I'm going to be kind of walking you through. It's located entirely on the Navajo Nation. The Navajo tribe have a gigantic reservation. It's huge. 27 plus thousand square miles. Not only is it in Arizona, but it also occupies part of Utah and northern New Mexico. It's gigantic, and there's a lot of really cool once-in-a-lifetime things to see on the Navajo Nation. So I just kind of sat down and went, how do I offer this to my guests? I have guests from all over the planet, of course, come here on vacation or they're attending business stuff. You might be one of those. And they're like, gosh, you know, this is something I probably wouldn't drive myself to, but it's absolutely incredibly beautiful. So I put together this brand new two-day tour. First day is Canyon de Chez. Pick you up as normal, 7 a.m. I like 7 a.m. for some reason. <laughs> for departure time, it kind of makes everything lay out pretty well. And then we drive to Canyon de Chez. It's a bit of a drive. It's over three hours to get there. So, again, our comfortable vehicles are really going to be appreciated. <laughs> a lot of them have TVs and stuff. But honestly, on the way to Canyon de Chez, there's a lot of really cool things to see. And of course, your guide will walk you through that. We get to Canyon de Chez. We'll go not only on the south Rim Drive, Scenic Drive, which is where probably 90% of the people that visit, that manage to get out there on their own, will visit. And there's a bunch of overlooks there. But we're also going to go to the north rim of the, can of the canyon. And you can look, you can see the canyon from that perspective. And that's really where there's a lot of history. There are going to be a lot more placards at the overlooks talking about the Native American history there. And if you choose, and this is extra, the Navajo tribe, they offer... Navajo guided tours into the canyon. We can't necessarily go down into the canyon. There's one trail that leads down, and I encourage all my guests, if they're not gonna do the Navajo-led tribe, uh, Navajo uh, tribe-led tour into the canyon itself, this is pretty good alternative. We can get you to that trailhead and you're perfectly okay to go down there, and it's super cool to do that too. But if you want to get really adventurous, we'll hook you up with one of the Native American tribe tours and you can go, they'll take you into the actual canyon. So you're kind of looking up at these incredible cliffs, the dwellings, the cliff dwellings are there. It's just really spectacular. But that is extra. That is on top of what we charge you to get you there and do our little thing. After we're finished there, we actually spend the night there. There's a couple of brand name hotels that are located right near where we're going to be. So we'll stay there. We arrange that for you. When you're doing your checkout, when you're picking this tour and going, oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> you'll have options to pick your hotel. Uh, what room, like a double queen or you know, a king, you'll have that option during checkout. But we're going to stay in that vicinity. And then day two, we get up, eat breakfast, of course, and then we head out to Antelope Canyon, which again is still on the Navajo Nation. It's about two hours from Canyon de Chez to Antelope Canyon. Again, kind of tells you how big this reservation is. And we'll arrange, of course, for your tour at Antelope Canyon. And we'll see Horseshoe Bend as well. There is no fee there. That's free. Antelope Canyon charges the Navajo Nation, the Navajo Tribe, charges a fee. Again, that's a Navajo Tribe member-led tour into that canyon. So you'll see that again. You'll be able to purchase your tickets on your checkout process on our website. You'll pick your tickets, how many people want to do it, and it's super easy. So we'll get you there. We'll arrange the time that you do your tour at Antelope Canyon, and then kind of depending on when we can do that for you. And here's kind of the catch-22. If you were to call me now, and right now it's January 2019, and you say, Todd, I really want to see Antelope Canyon. I really want to do Canyon de Chez. But I got to do it next week. We could probably make that work. Might not have the best time slot up at Antelope Canyon, but we can get you into the canyon at some point. And then we can adjust the day accordingly. If you wanted to add for $400 Monument Valley, again, another option during checkout, we can kind of figure that out. There might be enough time to do that. Now, if you call me even next month about a reservation in June, July, and August, which is their peak time, it's also the hottest time, believe it or not, but people are on vacation at that time, and say, Todd, I want to do it, it's hit and miss. Nine out of 10 times, I can contact a couple of people that I know up there and I can get you into the canyon. But there is always, always a chance that I can't on that day. 
So if that works out that way, I will recontact you and say, hey, anyway, we kind of tweak dates or anything. Odds are is I'll be able to do that for you. Again, I have some connections up there with some of the tribe members, but I can't guarantee it if it's last minute. Now, if you contact me in June, you're like, I want to go next week. <laughs> that would be super tough. It kind of depends on how big your group is. I have done it, but it's usually doubles, you know, couples or small groups. And then you can almost walk on. Somebody doesn't show up, get there, you kind of sit around and wait. Somebody doesn't show up for their tour. You can kind of fill in. But again, I'll walk you through all that if that becomes a problem. But I wanted to put together a really cool tour for my guests that may have seen the Grand Canyon in the past and really don't know really all the other stuff that's available in Arizona, such as Canyon de Chez, Antelope Canyon for that matter, and really kind of tailor a really cool zero stress premium vehicle and trust me, with all this driving, it's nice to be in a nice vehicle, not a, like a cheapo rental. And then have, of course, somebody kind of guiding you where you need to go, making sure you see all the really cool things that you need to see. So there you go. And that's so seven o'clock, Canyon de Chez. We spend the night near there. Second day, we get up, go to Antelope Canyon. At some point during the day, I'll, we'll get you into Antelope Canyon. And then, of course, Horseshoe Bend. That's easy. It's just a matter of a walk out and a walk back. There is no fee for that yet. And if we have other time, you know, depending on how everything kind of lays out for $400, you could even pack in Monument Valley another two and a half hours to get there. And then, of course, you're further away from home. So it's going to be a little bit of a long trip back. But that $400 kind of covers that. And there is a fee to get in there, too. And you'll see that as you check out. So there you go. Wow. <laughs> I uh, packed a bunch of stuff in. But go on the website. We have a brand new reservation system. It's super cool. It'll walk you through everything. You'll have an opportunity to purchase everything, make choices on the things you need to purchase. And then of course, we will reach out to you either by email, text message, or even a phone call. If we have any questions, if I, I touch everything personally, if I have any questions about how your day is gonna lay out, I will contact you, I won't hesitate. And then of course, you can always send me an email too. There's my emails all over the website. That comes directly to me. I don't have staff members that do that. I take care of that myself. So there you go. Man, I packed a lot of stuff in. Until the next video, I'll talk to you later. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Bye-bye.